For our beginner version, we repurposed our bungee cord catapult that we built. You can find on our YouTube channel. And I used the iPhone uh, 11 Pro Max at 240 frames per second slow motion to track with the peppers and the spices. I was actually really impressed by how amazing this turned out for being hand operated and just tracking it manually. Uh, the spices uh, looked really great. And here's our kit light in action as well. This shot is all about timing and accuracy and making sure the variables don't change on you. So using our catapult kit and our uh, pneumatic launcher, we launch the jalapenos in the air and we hit them with spices right as the camera is tracking with it. The only reason we're really using the Bolt robot on this shot is to extend the length of the shot. By tracking with the peppers, we have more time to capture all the action. So as you see here, we have the Phantom VO on the Bolt robot. We have a catapult that has spices on it. Uh, there's, it's all pneumatic powered, which means air powered. Here's one of our kit LED lights. And this is the launcher. And you can see there's some clay that we use to hold the peppers in place so they launch vertically. Um, we always put glass over the lens to make sure no spices get into the Phantom camera. And you can see we're shooting at about five, six and a half at 936 frames. Cool. For the intermediate version of our pepper spice shot, we actually used a slider to move the camera up and down as fast as we could to track with the pneumatic cylinder that was firing the peppers up in the air along with the spices. Uh, there were some challenges obviously to how fast the slider could go and the weight of the package. We had the Blackmagic 6K shooting at 120 frames per second with our zoom lens.